Hello, all of you lovely listeners, and welcome to another video here on Lily Budgets. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for your continued support. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Lily, and I am so thankful that you have clicked on this video and you're here to spend some time with me today. I am a 23 year old cash budgeter and stuffer, and we are really just trying to live life happy over here. So if that sounds like content that may interest you, I hope that you consider hitting that subscribe button and sending some support my way. But happy Cash Stuffing Tuesday, everyone. I hope that you're having a great day today. We are almost halfway through this week. You've got it. <laughs> um, but today we are here to stuff my full-time paycheck for the third week of December. We should have a total of $520 here because I did go ahead and leave some in the bank for my gym membership. So let's give it a quick count just to make sure. We have 100, 50, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, through 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 400, 410, 20, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 500, 505, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Perfect. <laughs> So, <clears throat> I don't know why it feels like I haven't chatted with you guys in a while, but how are you doing? Have you guys, if you know, if you celebrate, of course, have you guys gotten your tree yet? Real or fake? <laughs> um, just a few years ago, my family started cutting down real trees, and this was not only mine and Austin's first tree and first tree cutting experience living together but there was also no snow this year and it was definitely cold um but it definitely felt strange walking through the farm with no snow <clears throat> and this was a few weeks ago now but um I'm in the northern part of the country, so you'd expect there to be snow already, but I do think this weekend we are supposed to get some, and winter can officially start, which not like I'm really trying to push that, but you know. Alright, so we're going to start unstuffing our wallet here. Gas actually has $15 left. I think that the Pats game just kind of threw off my gas schedule because I didn't have to get gas again until Sunday. So I only put 25 in. I still have just about half a tank. And the rest of that will go into the jar. We're going to add 40 so... Per usual, 20, 35, and 40 is going to go into gas. And I'll try not to get gas until, like, I don't know, maybe Wednesday? Maybe? We'll see. Groceries has 5, 10, 11 left, so this will all go into the jar. Actually, just kidding. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna put 10 into our groceries buffer because <clears throat> why not? So groceries is getting 120, 50, two 20s, two 10s, and look at that on its last place. Okay, so groceries has 50, 70, 90, 100, 110, 115, and 120. Try to spend that five quickly. <laughs> this might be an issue. I'm gonna have to swap it over here for now. All right, eating out has one dollar left and we're gonna add 15. And that will be all that she has. Miscellaneous. Has one two dollars left. We're gonna add five, which should be all of these. One, two, three, four, five. And then work mails is empty, but we're gonna get ten and whoops. Some piece of it is breaking off. Alright, I can't rip it off, but 
We're going to put 10 in here. What is that? I am all over the place, you guys. <laughs> All right, I do have a ton of receipts to scan into Fetch. If you don't know, there's an app called Fetch that you can take pictures of your receipts. They will give you points, which you can rack up and redeem for gift cards to literally anywhere. If you use my code when you sign up and scan your first receipt, you'll get 2,000 points, which is equivalent to $2. And my code and link is in the description if you're interested. Thank you to everyone who has used my code. I do get some points as well, so I appreciate you. Um, for extra ones, I set one, two, three, four, five aside. Nice. And then before we add that up, I'm going to grab my coins. Yes, I still need to deposit that into the bank. All right. it inside out there. <laughs> All right, so that is going to do it for our wallet. And for everyone who has been asking, this is from Print Pression and it is linked in the description box. And then we have our little snowflake coin jar here. Okay, so not quite heavy enough that I can't hold it with one hand, but we'll get there. All right, so going into the jar this week, it's going to be another good one. 10, 15, 16, <laughs> 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. If the twisting and turning didn't throw all the counting off. All right. So, what? Okay. <laughs> so, this is another low income week. So, we're only stuffing a couple sinking funds, but that's okay. Franklin and Cedric are going to get 25. <clears throat> I know you guys just saw that, but I just got a text as I said that that said Franklin and Cedric. It did say just fell down our stairs, <laughs> but I did get a text that said Franklin and Cedric at the same time that I said Franklin and Cedric. So we're just gonna, we're gonna breeze past that, but that was pretty cool. <laughs> okay. So Frank and Ced have 1, 2, 300, 320, 40, 60, 80, 400, 420, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 6, 7, 8, and 49. So 449, I believe. <laughs> and then we are going to skip back to car care. My car care is getting 5. So we have 1, 2, 3, 400, 410, and 415 in car care. And then we are going to skip back to personal. And we're going to add 5. So we have 20, 30, 35, 40, and 45 in personal and over the weekend on Sunday night actually and then over to a friend from work's apartment with some other friends and we made some drinks and decorated some cookies and watched some Christmas movies and it was really fun. It was nice to get out of the house and do something with friends for a change so I did pull a little bit from personal for that and then I um went ahead and used some of my bonus buffer that's still in my safe. Um, Auntie's getting five. So we have 100, 150, 70, 80, 90, 95, and 200. And I really need to hanker down on 
planning for this because it is right around the corner. It's going to be here before I know it. But that is going to do it for our sinking funds. And then quickly, we're going to throw... Fifteen into toiletries. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 15, 20, 25, 30, and 35. 135 is in toiletries. And then we're going to skip back to our groceries buffer and add two fives from our wallet. So we have 20, 40, 50, 5, 65, and 70, which is fantastic. This is building up nicely. And that is it for our apartment binder today. And then lastly, we are going to hop back down to our big girl binder for our bills and then we'll go to savings so rent is getting 100 today so we have 1, 2, 300, 320, 40, 50, 65, and 370 in rent utilities is getting 25 so we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, and 125. In utilities, car is not getting anything, but insurance is getting 10. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50 in car insurance. And I only need one more week's worth of stuffings in order to um, finish off my bills. And we do have two more paychecks left this month because it is a magic month. So that is super exciting. So registration got five. We have 100, 510, and 115. In registration. Phone is also getting five, and we have 10, 25, 30, and 35 in phone. Annuals is fully funded. Best Buy is getting 15. So we have 20, 30, 40, 55, 60, and 65 in Best Buy. And then credit cards getting 10. So we have 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, and 60 in credit card. And then the student loans is getting 50. So we have 1,000 in the bank, 51, 5,200, 20, 40, and 50. So 1,250 dollars. Oh my gosh, you guys just saw that. It's been doing that lately, I don't know why. First home is getting 25. I still haven't made new placeholders. So I think I'm, I want to do a whole budget binder revamp, kind of like redo all my envelopes and my placeholders and have everything kind of be cohesive. So we'll see. But for now, first home has 500. 5,000, 500, 6,000 in the bank, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 220, 40, 50, 60, 70, and 75. So 6,275 dollars is in first home. You know what? As I said that I want things to be cohesive, these are just 
two other ones that I had lying around, but I'm going to switch them out just because, at least they're all green, but just because it's easier to, they're just thinner, so I can stick them in here. Alright, savings isn't getting anything, but manifest is getting five. So we have 500 in the bank, 6, 7, 800, 820, 40, 50, 65, 75, 85, and 90. So 800 and 90. Yeah, okay. 890. Emergency's not getting anything, neither is extra debt, but our 3k savings is getting 25. And why do I have an extra 10? You guys, did I mess something up? I don't know, we'll see. So 3k, before I count it, let's... Okay, so 3K has 1,500 in the bank, 6, 7, 8, 900, 950, 2,000, 2,000, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 15, 20, 25. So 2,125 is in 3K. I don't know where this extra 10 was supposed to go. And if I missed something, I will come back to it. But I'm just going to set it to the side for now. We are going to finish things off with a jar here. So this should be 24. We have 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, and 4. I'm going to go right into the jar. And that is going to wrap up today's cash stuffing. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Leave a big yellow heart in the comments to show your support for the channel. And of course, subscribe. Don't forget to check back in on Thursday for our Thankful Thursday side income at the cash stuffing. Um, but until then, thank you for sticking around with me. And I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day, week, month here <laughs> and I will see you in the next one. Bye!